This is a quick tutorial on how to find original newspaper film reviews using ProQuest Historical Newspapers database. And uh, anybody with a George Mason University library card can do this. Simply go into the databases link and you will be looking for ProQuest Historical Newspapers. So once it loads, I will have uh, go down about two-thirds of the way looking for ProQuest Historical Newspapers, and there it is. So we'll click here, and because we want a specific newspaper, the Washington Post, we have to click this Historical Newspapers icon. That will give me a choice of about ten newspapers to choose from from all around the country, and we want the Washington Post, so I'm going to hit search. Now I'm going to type in the word Citizen King. It's not really case specific, but I don't want every mention in the Washington Post of Citizen King since the film was released in 1941, so I've got to set some filters. I just want the original review that was published in 1941. So under search options, I'm going to click all dates and on this date. Now, I don't necessarily know the month and the day it was released in 1941, but I know the year, so I will just put that in, and I will scroll down and filter a little bit more. Because it was a movie, it was advertised every day in the movie section, so I don't want every single ad for Citizen Kane that appeared in the Washington Post because I would get hundreds of ads, and what I want is the original review. Now, as you go through these choices of what kind of documents we're looking for, you might think the most obvious thing would be to choose review. And that would not necessarily be the best choice because ProQuest really hasn't learned to differentiate between an article and a review. So um, I think I will just simply click article. That will bring up the review. I'll have to do a little bit of weeding. And we'll scroll up and hit search. There we go. Now, I, this is where it becomes less of a science and more of an art. There's go, there, there were 73 results from 1941, and I have to look at some of these headlines and decide which was the review. Well, number one, Board Select Citizen Kane as Best Movie of the Year probably came well after the film was released. Um, and so using that process of elimination, I'll end up on number four here, Citizen Kane at Keith's stamps Wells a genius, simple biographical story distinguished by production values that make it a revolutionary contribution to the cinema. I can see if that is the original review, and um, I can scroll down here a bit and uh, look at the original thing here. I can pull the um, thing down, and this is definitely the original review of Citizen King. So I have the choice of printing it, I have the choice of downloading it and saving it, um, and I was able to find this review in less than five minutes.